Yo, boys, Armors to Simulator got a brand new update, and that's the Hunt World right here. And apparently, it's a whole brand new world that we gotta beat, so we gotta do that in this game. I haven't played Arm Wrestle Sim for a while, so I might be a little bit rusty, but I think I could do it, guys. It doesn't look that hard. So, looks like I need only 115 strength, but every time I click, I get eight. Oh, that's really good, bro. I'm guessing that's because all my game passes. And then there's dumbbells over here. We got this right over here. That gives me 36 every time. Yo, dude, we got already beat the starter boss right here let's go and with my auto click game pass i've got one hunt gems and two golden keys and i guess the only thing you could do is spend your hunt, hunt gems for ryan bananas for luck potion star fruit and then what there is is a dark axolotl which is 500k stats and 2x of whatever this uh strength is and you also have a chance to get a best friend nine pet which is really op and then a cyber arm which is 2950 percent and let's check it out guys let's see my best arm currently is 5460 percent i want to get that arm to see if that arm is going to be very op if you make it golden i mean it should be very op and it also gives 20 percent of the strength that's in this area so that's actually really good too so you know what let's go right over here auto grind biceps that gives me 17 and i could get even better biceps so even better dumbbells so uh, already i'm getting 34 and with the best knuckles that gives me only 36 so the best thing to grind is 100 biceps because these dumbbells are gonna be so op it's already better than knuckles and it gets even better as you get more strength like there we go i'm already getting 51 every time and i have a thousand of this hunt strength and there's no other way to get other pets other than buying these which kind of sucks so all right what do we gotta do now we gotta beat luna all right luna 800 uh recommended there we go. i got five hunt gems not bad and then we also got hunter harry that requires 5.7k recommended okay i guess it gets a little hard over there oh and look i guess you could get a starter pet right there and then if you beat this guy and then if you beat the lunar final boss you get a chance of a best friend nine it's op pet all right bro we're gonna have this go in the biceps 2.5k right over here oh dude i'm gonna get this unlocked so fast the last dumbbell is 50k recommended and you need 4.7 million dude oh this this actually gets difficult, bro. All right, so for me to be Hunter Harry, I need 5.7k. I just got enough over here for this. There we go. Let's check out our pets. Our pets don't multiply our hunt strength. I'm trying to find, is there other ways to get hunt strength? I don't think there is. Like, any other way to multiply it. I mean, top 50 hunt strength leaderboard players are at 240 million, 750 million and stuff. And then you need at least 4.7 million to beat that guy, which I don't think should be that hard i mean as long as you get all these dumbbells i think it should be pretty easy like i'm already at 5.4k so i should be able to defeat hunter harry right over here and then oh wait i do have a multiplier bro it says i have 11.7k oh i think because my game passes so i actually have double anyway he gives me 25 hunt gems every time so i'm at 81 hunt gems currently and with 81 hunt gems i can't really buy anything i mean i could buy a ryan banana once i get 100 sure why not maybe it might change and maybe there might be hunt gems potions or something or maybe a hunt strength potion let's see if i buy it what happens uh it just says sold out so you just can't buy another one of those so then i guess i have to get all this other stuff over here oh it did this change yeah it did change so it's a limited time gone once uh it will never come back yo so it's never going to be coming back all right so it's 100 percent. i gotta be grinding all this and buy everything from the shop literally everything we have to buy this so this thing i gotta buy that's gonna multiply my hunt trick by 2 2x and this multiplies by 20 percent so but those things are really expensive like bro 150k just for the dark axolotl pet there's gotta be other ways bro there really has to be i don't think there honestly is though might have to ask like the discord server or something oh there we go we got 20 kg unlocked getting 133 strength every time with it and then about to get 15k once i get 15k like right now 25 kg we're getting 150 died every time well i mean other ways to get hunt strength it should be from defeating these bosses over here because i'm guessing there's a chance to drop this starter pet and that starter pet probably gives you a hunt strength multiplier so i need 575 517.5k at least to beat this guy and if i could beat him i might be able to get that pet and then that pet's gonna be extremely op so i think that's very well worth it currently i'm at 100 kg dumbbell about to be at 50k what to get 
250k. That's the best dumbbell. And then I just got to keep it auto grinding to get 500k. That is extremely annoying to get and will take a long time. But I mean, I guess I got to do what I got to do. I might just have an auto clicker going. And it also sucks how this right here, the VIP punching bag, literally is horrible. I mean, man, if, if that's horrible, there should be at least a VIP dumbbell, bruh. Oh, does this spinner have anything new? It got a glitch dragon. That's new from the time I've been playing this game. And no, it does not get punch strength multipliers at all, bro. Come on. All right, so I'm a little over in strength. I have 60k, but we can get the best dumbbell. So now every time I get 272 every time. And I'm at 63k currently. So I got to do that a lot of times. And I get up to at least 500k or maybe 250k. I want to test that 250k because it looks like I actually have double strength when fighting these bosses. So if I get like 250,000 strength or something like that, I think I might be able to defeat the second to last boss. All right, so I got a little more than half. So this should be enough, I think. Yup, there you go. With the auto clicker, it actually works. So I just beat him. And oh, I got the pet. And it gives it 2x. Wait a second. What if I just keep spamming it? Will it just keep giving it to me? Or is it just like you only get it once? Oh, no. You only get it once, bro, I think. Or maybe I just got lucky and you could get it multiple times. But you're just not going to get it multiple times because of how rare it is. I don't know. But let's see, guys. So what was that pet even called? It's I, I don't even know what it's called, bro. I, I already missed it. Oh, no. I got to find it through this whole thing. No, I can't do that. It's going to take way too long. Well, while I try to find in my inventory, I have the auto train going as well. So I can at least get some strength because this is going to take a while. But I mean, with this pet, it should multiply it by 2x if I could just find in my inventory, bro. Oh, I think there it is. This, Yep, that's it right there. Okay, perfect. Let's equip that. And then now I get 453 every time. Not too bad. So for me to beat this boss right here, the final boss, I need 4.7 divided by 2. Whatever that is. Like 2 billion. So like 2.35 million. So that's not that bad, guys. I mean, I could get that. It's just gonna take a while. But bro, can I get like more of these pets over here? Like I, it's really not possible to get more of these pets? I guess it's not. I mean, I get 125, 125 gems with that every time. Bro, how am I supposed to get 300k, dude? 300k gems? That's gonna be kind of difficult, bro. But if I get the last boss defeat, I might be able to. That's going to take a while, though. I mean, all of it's just going to take a while. We got upgrades right here. I'm not sure if this helps, but uh, apparently I have this one equipped right now, and then I can't get any other one. Okay, that's not going to help. I mean, any of this helps? I don't know if it does. I mean, does a two times wins potion help with this? Let's see. So every time with this guy, I get 125, right? So now I get two times wins potion going, and with the two times wins potion, does that multiply? It. Let's see. Ah, oh, still get 125. Let's see if that's just like a visual thing. I have 506. And yup, it gives you 125. Okay. So can't do that. Looks like it's just, it just is what it is. Just, just grind strength. Get enough strength to defeat that boss. Grind that guy till I could get those pets. I mean, another way I can multiply it is using this fruit right here. So it costs 5,000. I gotta check if I have my own. But it gives you a 10% training speed boost, which is pretty much faster hunt strength so let's go right here to our items and for sure let's use that so i train a little bit faster it gives me more strength this says it gives you fighting strength i'm not sure if that helps with this but let's test it no it doesn't okay well then that was not the best thing to do because that literally did nothing but i kind of wasted that fruit but anyway i am using that whatever the other one is the raw and dragon fruit that one's good because it gives you even more training speed so that's worth it. I guess I'll use some more of those because it only lasts for five minutes. So let's put like 15 minutes of that and see where we can end up with. We're at a million strength currently. So if I get like one more million, a little more than one more million, I should be able to defeat that final boss. So it's a little less than half. But let's see if we could beat the final boss with the amount of strength I have. And just barely. It's extremely slow, but it is possible. And that, that's kind of why I need to grind a little bit more. But I did get the Robo Dragon. And you 650 of the Hunt Gems every time. So that's actually really, really good. And let's go get that Robo Dragon. Now that gives you a 4x for the amount of strength I get. So that's extremely good. So now I could grind the Hunt Strength and get a ton. I'm getting it really fast now. I'm thinking let's get to like 2.4 million strength or something like that. I'm currently at 2.2. And then right after that, we got to grind hunt gems to get the cyber arm, 
which shouldn't be too hard to get the cyber arm and axolotl because he literally gives 650 hunt gems every time i beat him so in order for me to get those two items fast i need to beat it beat that boss really fast which means i need to get 2.4 maybe 2.5 million strength and those two pets are helping so much because now instead of like 500 every time I uh, lift this barbell or this dumbbell, now I get 1.7k. Alright, so now with 2.5 million, let's go auto fight this boss. Okay, it does it a lot faster now than what it was. But I mean, if it was just a little bit more faster, that would be a lot better. And I, I mean, don't get me wrong. I am getting 100 gems really fast. But like, if it's just a little bit faster, that would be a lot nicer. So, I mean, if I could do that, that would be a W. I'm at 2.6 million right now. Let's get it up a little bit more. All right, 3 million is honestly good enough. So now I could just auto fight this boss. That's a decent speed. And let's just get a ton of these hunt gems and start buying some pets and the best arm. And you can see how fast it's going up because I'm already at 5,000 hunt gems. I believe to get one of the pets, it's 150,000. So it is very expensive, but we could get there. I mean, I spent so much time just getting the strength. So it just got up to 130,000. That's almost enough for me to buy the first pet. And the pet honestly won't do that much for me. All it's going to do is multiply the amount of strength I get. So that's if I grind some more strength, which I could do to defeat this boss faster, which will allow me to get more gems. But for me to actually get the arm that I'm looking to get, which is the best you could get in this update, costs 300,000, which is double what I already have. So I don't know what's more worth it. I honestly might just go for the arm and then go for the pet after because if I go for the arm, that's already going to multiply my strength, which will already allow me to do this a little bit faster, which would be pretty good, I'd say. So probably just grind this until I get up to 300k. It's, it's very time consuming. That's what I'll tell you guys. Like I'm at 135,000, not even halfway there yet, and it's been a very long time. And there we go, boys. I have 400,000 gems. That's enough to get the pet right now, and also I could get the arm. So right now, I'll just get the arm for 300,000, and you're only allowed to buy one. So I'll buy that one right there. There we go. We got the cyber arm, and let's go check it out. And where is it? There it is right there. You can still obviously upgrade it, but let's go use that arm since it multiplies my hunt strength. And then now if I go check my strength, guys, 3.6 million. And if we go auto fight here, I have 7.2 million strength. And I'm literally beating this boss way faster, which would give me a lot more gems a lot faster. So now they have 101.8k gems. I got to get this dark axle auto right here, which is only 150k. I only need 50k more, which is nothing too crazy. So might as well grind some more to get that pet, which I am very close to getting. I get 625 hunt gems every time. And there's no way to increase that. If only there was, but I've literally checked everything and I don't think there's a way to increase it. So I guess I'll sit here till I get 150,000 gems and then we could get that pet. All right, so I actually got a lot of hunt gems now. And then now with all of these, we could go back over here and start buying a lot of stuff. So apparently everything just restocked. I'm not sure how that even happened, but we could get the dark axolotl right there. And I think you could probably restock them like every time you probably like leave the game or rejoin or something. But anyway, let's get the dark axolotl right over here equipped. Gotta unequip something, so let's unequip that guy and then equip one of these. Bam, we get even more strength every time, which is pretty sick. And yeah, I do have a lot of uh, gems as well left over. So I guess we could buy some of this right there, buy some of that, and buy some of that. Literally just getting everything dude and i could grind some more and get another one of the cyber arms to probably make it golden but i guess that'll be it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed so make sure you guys like subscribe and comment down below any other games i should beat and also other videos you guys want me to do because pet sim is getting kind of dry i'm not even gonna lie and armor is getting some pretty decent updates like this one right here and i'm not even gonna lie dude i beat this update actually pretty quick i mean the only thing that took me a lot of time or actually challenged me is these two 
new bosses right here. Because if you take a look at it, bro, it's like 150 recommended, which is pretty much free. Same with the 805. Then it gets pretty hard with 5.7k recommended. But then again, divide all those numbers by two because of a simple gate pass that you could get. And that simple gate pass is, I believe, one of these right here, right? Uh, well, auto click, that's one of them. And another one is one of the strengths, your fighting strength, which is a very expensive game pass, but very well worth it. And then we got this right here that's extremely hard, 517.5k. That took me out of an hour to get. And this thing took me probably an hour or two to get as well, which was pretty crazy. So, yeah, it was kind of annoying as well, but it is what it is. It doesn't really matter. And, I mean, now I can just beat them extremely fast with all the strength I have now. So, that's a W. And get tons of hunt gems. I could leave that on auto grind. So, then maybe I could just keep rejoining service and get a ton of these arms and get a ton of these dark axolotls. But you honestly don't really need to that because all this is really good for is the hunt, which is just one event that won't be coming back ever to the game. I mean, it even says it right there, limited time, once it's gone, it will never come back. So I don't know if that's worth it. I mean, you could just spam tons of these fruits so you don't have to do anything else, but it's really up to you. Anyway, that's going to be it for this video. Hope you guys enjoy. See you later and peace.